Hello and welcome everyone to a new video here on my channel, this time just a short informational video for Ace Combat 7 and the ADF-11F Raven aircraft, which has so far only been an AI aircraft, has just been pretty much confirmed as a playable aircraft for Ace Combat 7 and, well, I think some people already knew or well, supposed to, or were supposed to know that this was gonna happen, um, because some files present inside the game files were already hinting at this aircraft becoming available as a player aircraft, such as the UAVs having their own weapon datas, um, this aircraft having texture files in the same resolution as player aircraft, and so it was only a matter of time in my opinion, until this aircraft appeared as playable aircraft in Ace Combat 7. Now, like I said on Twitter, a short clip showing the UAVs, I will link that in the description, um, has been shown. There will be more footage of it on YouTube, I believe. We will see. So, um, yeah, this is just a short informational video showing the actual model up close, maybe some detailed specifications, um, some comparison to other US-made fighters. Well, I'm not implicating that this is US-made, but you get what I mean. So, let's take a first look. So, this is the aircraft as you can see it in Ace Combat 7 inside the game itself. Um, it's got, of course, the usual Falcon characteristics like uh, the engines, the intakes, the body right here, but alright, so one thing you can clearly see here is the Zone of Endless emblem, and actually this is one of the player textures, which is 4K in resolution. For comparison, let me switch to here. Uh, ignore the darker color, but this is the texture you can actually see in-game while fighting the AI version. So you can of course see here with the emblem, it's um, it's it's uh, a lot more low resolution than the actual player texture. So let's switch again here. This is the player texture, and this is actually wait. This is actually the default texture. It's white or, well, light gray with red emblems, red warning signs. And I think this is pretty much the color it also appears at Aces at War 2019 in. There are some pictures of the aircraft showing it in this light color. So, yeah, there's that. Um, here we have the weapon UAV, which we saw the clip of. Um, it's actually got quite a high resolution texture for just being such a small object. Um, its texture file has the same resolution as any AI aircraft like big bombers or well the ADF Elf uh, 11 <laughs> F we have seen so far. So yeah, um, probably in game it won't use this high resolution texture file just like the aircraft don't use the 4K resolution file during missions but only in the hangar. But yeah, you can see the gun ports. I'm not quite sure if there's a part missing here or not, otherwise I'm not quite sure why it has this gap in here. Perhaps as attachment point. I don't really know where this thing is supposed to be attached anyway. So, um, yeah. Oh yeah, I forgot, uh, just like the Falcon, the aircraft has uh, its retractable bottom rudder right here. The weapon base right here, it doesn't actually have the weapon base model. You can only see the inside of the weapon base because this is uh, the AI model. It doesn't have any landing gear either, so yeah, expect um, the player aircraft to have all those parts. Alright, what else? Um, yeah, we've got these aircraft right here, just for a size comparison, because this thing, as we all knew already, is kind of huge. We've got the F-22, we've got the F-15C, we've got the F-35C, and we've got the F-16C. 
So as you can see, this is um, quite a bit larger. I'm really, uh, well, wondering how it's gonna fit inside all the hangars, especially the aircraft carrier. So just for reference, this thing is... Where do we see it? Uh, nope, 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 boundary box. So this thing is approximately 26 meters long, well, more like 27, 18 meters uh, wide and 4.5 meters high. So even without landing gear, it's really a huge aircraft. All right, what else? Uh, there's not really much else. Here we can see the detached UAV, which is quite large in itself. I think when you're fighting it, it doesn't actually look that large, but let's take the F-22 for comparison. Um, the dimensions are quite big. Overall, I mean, it seems to be bigger than an F-16. Yeah, it's bigger than an F-16, so... Yeah, this is pretty much all there is to it. Just some little juicy information. Can't wait for this new aircraft to finally come out, but I still hope we get the uh, ADF X01 or 02 Morgan, perhaps the original ADF 01 Falcon. Um, those are just the OG aircraft, and I really love them. Just like the CFA 44. I actually like most of those fictional aircraft, so um, yeah, let's see what other aircraft we will get. I hope you enjoyed this video and the additional information, perhaps um, they were kind of interesting for you, if not, well, too bad you still watch this video. And um, yeah, thanks for watching, I hope you're as excited as I am, and then I'll see you in the next video, whatever that'll be. Until then, as always, take care and thanks for watching.